We have some new developments out of North Korea. We talked about the story yesterday. We're now learning that the rogue nation has just finished installing a long-range rocket on its launch pad and may now only be days away from firing it. Greg Palcott's live in London, covering it from there. Many trips to North Korea. Greg, what are you hearing? Hey, Bill. We are hearing that the launch could happen as early as Monday. Our sources on the ground in South Korea backing up what we're hearing from the media in the region, and they are saying that the three-stage rocket is now assembled at the launch site in the northwestern part of the country. If the fueling is finished by the end of the weekend, the launch could happen between December 10 and December 12. That's the first three days of the launch window. Now, that would follow a pattern of what we, we saw when we were last there for the failed launch in April. Now, like then, North Korea says this is all for peaceful purposes. They just want to put up a satellite. Others say it's really a cover to test a missile to launch a nuclear payload, which is why we are seeing that region on high alert. Japan deploying Patriot missiles, South Korea revving up a brand new Israeli-made missile defense radar system. Both these countries promise to shoot down anything that might go astray, Bill. Wow. Uh, what is the North Korean government saying about it this time, Greg? Well, all of this means a lot to the new young leader, Kim Jong-un. It is meant to mark the first anniversary of the death of his father, the former leader, Kim Jong-il, as well as to mark the end of a year, which is supposed to show that this impoverished nation is on its way to being strong and prosperous. So what we are seeing is Pyongyang managing the message even more than usually, usual, both domestically and internationally. My contacts say that this country could very well call this launch successful, Whatever happens, Secretary of State Clinton is in Europe this week at a meeting at, at NATO in, in Brussels. Her message is pretty clear, too. The U.S. is concerned. It wants the US, North Korea to stop. The reason, also pretty clear, if this missile works, Bill, the range could be as long as over 6,000 miles. That would put the, whatever it's launching in that payload in range of Los Angeles. Well, Greg, thank you. Greg Palcott watching now that of London, six minutes past.